half. My dad's a muggle. Mum's a witch. Bit of a nasty shock for him when he found out. I, rabbit, harpstring hum. Turn this water into rum. I, rabbit, harpstring hum. What's Seamus trying to do to that glass of water? This is why mom doesn't fucking love you! <laughs> Turn it to rum. Oh, she managed to eat tea yesterday. Before. <laughs> when God Leviosa. Well done, when dear. God... <laughs> oh. I think we're going to need another feather over here, Professor. Leglock, of course. Malfoy. <laughs> You have got to start standing up to people, Neville. How? I can barely stand at all. I'll do the counter, Chris. No, that's all I need. You to set my bloody kneecaps on fire. I don't appreciate the insinuation, Longbottom. Besides, if anyone cares to notice, my eyebrows have completely grown back. Longbottom's been neglecting his earmuffs. No, ma'am. He's just fainted. Yes, well, just leave him there. Right, on we go. Oh, no. Look, everyone. Weasley's got himself a howler. Fortuna Major. <laughs> Here, listen. She just won't let me in. Fortuna Major. That's a monkey. Furious. We haven't had the end of this. He's been silent! He's been silent! Who? Serious Black! <laughs> Dufftown? It's not far from here. You don't think he comes to Hogwarts? Do you? With Dementors at every entrance? Dementors. He's already slipped past the months, hasn't he? Who was to say he won't do it again? That's right. Black could be anywhere. It's like trying to catch smoke. Like trying to catch smoke with your bare hands. Well, I'll take it upstairs and don't set him. Harry! Wherever did you get it? Can I have a go, Harry? After you, of course. What are you talking about? Be quiet! What son he's drinking, do you suppose? I don't know, but I don't think it's... What you're up against! You need to be prepared! You need to find another place to put your chewing gum besides the underside of your desk, Mr. Finnegan! Oh, no way. The old codger can see at the back of his head. I'm here across classrooms! Yeah. <laughs> Better than Seamus, is anyway. My mum didn't want me to come back this year. Why not? Let me see, uh, because of you. The Daily Prophet's been saying a lot of things about you, Harry. And about Dumbledore as well. What, and your mum believes them? Well, nobody was there the night Cedric died. Oh, well, I guess you should read The Prophet, then, like your stupid mother. It'll tell you everything you need to know. Don't you dare talk about my mother like I'll that. I'll have a go at anyone that calls me a liar. What's going on? He's mad as what's going on. Do you believe the rubbish he's come out with about you know who? Yeah, I do. Has anyone else got a problem with Harry? Harry. Oh, yeah. Uh, I wanted to apologise. Now with me mum says the prophet's version of things don't add up. So, what I'm really trying to say is that I believe you. I'm counting on you, Ron. I have two guys on Gryffindor, yeah? Hey, listen up, you lot. I brought you a surprise. Not more rabbit for it. Cooking, I hope. Be a surprise if we can digest it. Fine. Six months you haven't seen me, and it's like I'm Frankie first year. Only a brother. Shut lots of those up. She's only one, Harry. Shut up, shut up. How on earth are we going to do that? Why don't you confer with Mr. Finnegan? As I recall, he has a particular proclivity for pyrotechnics. I can bring it down. That's the spirit. Where are you going? 